Well, this man's accused of causing a massive crash and fire on I-70. And this morning, we know that semi-truck driver that caused it all allegedly is out on bond. Mackenzie O'Keefe is live at the Jefferson County Courthouse this morning with more on what happened and how he got out. Mackenzie. Good morning, Britt. Yeah, this truck driver is said to be responsible for that deadly crash that ended up being a 28-car pileup that was on I-70 near Denver West. We do know that this weekend he was able to post bail and walk out of the Jefferson County Jail. Now, his wife did post on Facebook around midnight on Saturday, saying in part, quote, we have done it at last. Free Rahel just an hour ago. Thank you to everyone so much for the support. Now, this is the truck driver, Rahel Aguilera Medeiros. He's being held on a $400,000 bond in the Jeffco jail. Again, he was able to post that bail this weekend. Police say he was traveling 85 miles per hour down I-70 when he crashed into dead stop traffic, killing four people. He's been charged with four counts of vehicular homicide, six counts of first degree assault, and 24 counts of attempted first degree assault. Now, we did see that friends and family were trying to raise money for him. That was through a GoFundMe account and more recently through some Facebook fundraisers. That money was to go towards his bail and also his legal fees. He is expected back here in court in July. We're live here in Jefferson County. Mackenzie O'Keefe covering Colorado first. Mackenzie, thanks very much.